Welcome to the March 2017 CEO message from AmCham. I'd like to start with a brief update uh, this month about the upcoming study that the uh, American Chamber of Commerce has commissioned with the United States Study Center at the University of Sydney. We'd like to pick apart and examine the greatest uh, economic relationship that Australia enjoys with any partner at all, um, anywhere in the world, that's the United States. Uh, we're looking particularly at the robust uh, two-way investment relationship uh, that totals something like $1.5 trillion in total funds uh, invested. Much of that is foreign direct investment. We'd like to look in detail about how different investments by American companies in Australia and Australian companies in the United States have transformed the economic landscape of each country. So we'll be working on that over the next few months with our partners. Stay tuned for more updates. Uh, in March, we're looking forward in particular next week to the Canberra door knock. We're taking five different AmCham committees uh, for the first time uh, to Canberra. We'll be knocking doors mainly on Parliament, but also uh, around uh, the city to different uh, organizations, different uh, government agencies and regulatory bodies uh, to bring AmCham's views to the fore about how to maintain Australia as the best possible place uh, to do business uh, in the world. The five committees that are going this time are taxation, uh, defense and security, health, innovation, and trade and government. So uh, it's, we're actually full up this, uh, this time, but if you're interested in joining us, we'll probably be going back to Canberra uh, in uh, September or October. We'd also like to call your attention to our Washington door knock. This is your chance to go to Washington and experience the Trump administration very early in its genesis. Uh, we'll be meeting major players in the administration. We'll be knocking on doors uh, in the Congress and, br and making sure that uh, views from Australia and from the Asia Pacific region are well understood uh, in Washington, D.C. Um, We'd also like to call your attention to some uh, trade missions that we're going to be bringing to uh, the United States in the September-October uh, period. You'll find the details on our website, but the first one will look at infrastructure, opportunities for Australian companies to benefit from what we think that the Trump administration will do in the infrastructure space. Two weeks later, from the 16th to the 20th of October, we'll have a defense and security uh, mission that will go to Virginia, Washington, D.C., and Mobile, Alabama. And finally, uh, at the end of the month, we'll be doing uh, another innovation mission, this time to Boston and then Silicon Valley. So check our website for details. Now, as always, we've got a robust calendar of events coming up. I'll just mention a few in May across Australia. Uh, you'll find the details on our website. We'll be doing a Trump administration after 100 days uh, review with expert panels in five cities. We're also bringing Larry Marshall, the CEO of CSIRO, uh, to New South Wales audiences here in Sydney on the 28th of April. In Greater Western Sydney on the 21st of June, Lucy Turnbull on a panel looking at the development of that uh, vibrant part of the Sydney landscape will uh, take place. Uh, that will be in Western Sydney. In Melbourne, we'll be looking at the NBN with CEO Bill Morrow on the 20th of April. Queensland will be examining business in the United States, doing business with the United States on the 5th of uh, April uh, in Brisbane. In Western Australia, on the 19th of April, we're having, uh, having a very interesting panel on defense, special operations, and how that can affect your business in a positive way. And finally, down in Adelaide, uh, we'll be picking apart the shared economy, looking at companies like Uber and Airbnb, and what that might mean for the economy uh, in and around Adelaide. That's on the 19th of May. Plenty of things to uh, choose from. That's just a sampling. Check out our website. Come down to see us in any of the cities where we're present. And finally, before I sign off, I'd like to welcome the following companies to the AmCham family. All of these companies have joined since the last CEO message. Ontera, Formation Technologies, Cargo Line International, Blue Jeans, Synthesis Consulting, PROS Technology, Beckon, Altair Engineering Solutions, 2186, 
and Tamar Group. Please uh, join me in welcoming these companies to the Amsham family. And if you're not already a member, uh, we can help you do something about that too. I wish you a really successful month of business and look forward to speaking to you again in a month. Thank you.